ke Rainbow of Sounds Music School kepada nak senang Maubri Ribhoi District kepada perlong sisim cita yo hak sing saja nya Little Flower High Secondary School Maubri kedon bunjait ke kom hikai hak liang ke tem keput pat karwai ke siau keyboard guitar western vocal indian classical vocal kasi instruments pat kasi vocal ki kena ki bahan nyos dem seneng kila ban wan pentebit hak nang music school bat om dem jing e nak menta ki larang baru ban wan pentebit hak nang music school Ka jela megalea kala pun kere na dong shodong ban priang borom mia kino yalam jong kiri ke pertei ki ban wan yashim penta ha ke jingelang G20 summit space economic leaders mean. U principal secretary ke tenat planning u shagil ahmad u la pun tiba arpo prangut ke he officer na kiri pe perpo per bar palat shis pangut ke delegates kin wan ban yashim penta kentup de ya ki tiknokran. U shagil u long ru ba kende ke kabu ya ke jela ban pen i la ke jong ke deiti ten rai ke bak kamper bat ke spa amariang bat kam tap e ke jik hoj bat ke akor ke burom namar ban wan kum kine ke he officer se ke jela me galia ke long ke baca ci sin lano e bat dei ru ban pen i ya ke e ke bab hatam kena makin leit pai da ke jing sa jing ken mau bat sengot tenat bat ke ban long ru ke ban nirap ban pen i nam bat ken tiu ya ke me galia kum ke wei ne ke cika ban wan sang kai pengat ke ban ken syau kam bat ke roi ke par Hadu arpo prahaki long seng kam ha ka space economy kin wan bani sim penta ha ke negeri jinglang bat kin sa pen i ya ke ege ege kam beki le sa bar jong ke negeri jinglang ula penrap bana lor ka ISRO kan don ru ka jing penam da ki kendun start up ha ka space economy the space is the best technology that can be come uh, that can be uh, what you call used for the especially with the part of things we have other satellites we have inside satellites and we have models which will predict the weather in a very pretty probabilistic way 90% 60 to 70% probability using the space technology but it is not enough if you have technology somebody should be there to raise the occasion you play the technology and put it into the applications so this is more important capacity building is very important for us we have to train the people we have to educate the people we have to develop the tools and necessary infrastructure that is required for utilizing these tools for the common man that is the part of this exercise in fact any sec is doing the same thing now drone applications are coming to predicting avalanches to predicting uh, even resources yes, uh, la last time i was in arunachal pradesh the tcm was telling how what are all the different crops that are possible in this area soil fertility is possible soil moisture is can be assessed through space technologies In a way, we can assess very easily what kind of crops can grow here. But if human beings don't change, how can uh, it's a change? Yes, change because now being in the shoes. Uh, just to sort of introduce you all to the space uh, economy leaders meeting, which is part of the G20 uh, Gen Bhagidari thing happening across the country. We are fortunate that Shillong has been selected. as an uh, venue for a, such a major event wherein we expect about uh, 28 diplomats from various countries and uh, more than 100 uh, to delegates also participating including technocrats uh, it would be a rare occasion and an opportunity for the state to showcase our own unique culture our uh, natural beauty our own cuisine and uh, Uh, most uh, d- uh, sought after cleanliness hygiene and hospitality and getting such a high level delegates to come to our state is a rare occasion so we should uh, not only from the government side from the entire community and citizenry should present the best uh, foot forward uh, so that they go back with good memories fond memories and that will help help in showcasing and benchmarking and positioning meghalaya as a prime destination of tourism investment and development we would have uh, about uh, 28 startups uh, in the space economy sector participating in the event and we would also have exhibits by the side of the conference which is going to be held in marriott you all are aware uh, apart from the uh, isro government of the agency there would be exhibitions exhibits by the startups also in the space economy industry we would also showcase our own cultural heritage there will be cultural events and also stalls from the side of media uh, i would uh, urge uh, the friends from the media also to really reflect the positive aspect of bengaluru so that the delegates during their visit also see about 
whatever the vibrancy of our society, goodness of our community, and all our community-based development which we have done so far, which has really positioned us one of the topmost country in community-based preservation, protection of nature, and conservation. Uh, with this, if you have a specific thing on the um, uh, technical aspect of the uh, G20, I would uh, welcome that. Otherwise, this is a part of the G20 presidency is given to India from 2022. You're all aware of that. It is on circulation, rotation. So this is once in a 20-year opportunity for India to showcase ourselves. So this, across the sector, one good thing which we happened is we are sort of celebrating it as a Jan Bhagidari. The entire G20 is taken to a level of people's participation. So instead of doing it in one city, it is done in every city, most of the cities and most of the capitals. So that is where, uh, even for this event, there's something called econom economy, uh, responsibility and alliance creation. So in a sector like space economy, you need alliances because it's a technology is something which is naive and at a different level. If the countries can't participate and share, it can't really get into the fruitful end. So in the, with this uh, in mind, earlier G20 uh, countries like Kingdom, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, Italy and Indonesia has also since 2020 has done these kind of events for collaboration. So this is a sort of continuity for that which we are doing uh, in uh, Shillong. Uh, the theme of the G20 is one earth, one space and one future, which is part of our national ethos, Vasudeva Kudumbagam. So this is where we pitch in and we would like to have a positive alliance and collaboration across the globe for a better future for the mankind. Thank you very much. Amitabh Kant, we also have uh, the head of bilateral cooperation of Roscosmos, the state uh, space agency of Russia, and the director also attending. We have minister from China attending, uh, minister Con the, from minister the Council. Yeah, minister council, and uh, almost uh, 10, more than 10 ambassadors attending. So it's a big event. I think we should be able to project ourselves in a positive manner. Uh, and uh, it would really lead the way for space application for the public also. This is what I mean, I'm sure one of the gentlemen has mentioned. It should be helpful for predicting, modeling, the changing nature and how to prevent it. It's going to happen at Bangalore from 6th and 7th of July. Uh, most of the ambassadors will be coming over here for this precursor event. Right? Basically, diplomacy is only the way to take it forward. Any any kind of such kind of alliances or cooperations and coordinations, as principal secretary has mentioned. So this event basically concentrates on the main event, how it is going to organize, and rather a precursor event to showcase all the capabilities in the space economy and space the potential capabilities of ISRO because having spent almost 50 years Indian Space Research Organization and Department of Space has acquired self-reliance and capabilities in not only in the launch vehicle, satellite, satellite applications and navigations. So this particular message we want to give it to the world stating that collaborations are possible for future science missions where the space is going to be very uh, what you call expensive uh, in industry or uh, proposition and especially space sciences we require collaboration so these are all the things we wanted to spell it out and India in more to say that why economy has been added is because of the land use land mass and huge uh, let us say the population opportunity huge opportunities are available in India now post uh, this post uh, uh, let us say uh, reforms which were announced by the government of India more industry is pitching in into the space domain unlike earlier. These are all the opportunities international uh, business com business communities and business stalwarts can come over to India either through FTAs or joint ventures or consortiums to expand the space business so that our economy will be improved. So why this particular chosen, the Sri Lanka has chosen is Northeast states are very, very important for us because of hilly areas, potential is more and the reachability is also more. Even in spite of such kind of hard conditions, the space applications is the best, let us say, technology for improving the social life, the economy and utilizing the natural resources. So that is the reason, incidentally, we have a Northeast Space Application Center doing a great job uh, in extending the necessary technologies to the uh, northeastern states. So we wanted to showcase that here also in this area also we have 
a lot of potential opportunities for the space industries to come, invest, contribute to the uh, economy and society uh, of the Indian community. That is the reason. Uh, the next main event would be in July 6th and 7th at Bangalore. This is the precursor to that main event, which as Dr. Beda was mentioning about, we will explain in the third session what we are going to discuss more when heads of space agencies will come to main event during July.